guys so i just got back from the grocery store i went to aldi's and i went to walmart just because i couldn't find everything that i needed at aldi's so i just want to do a little grocery haul and then i just want to go in on my fridge and clean it out and that's what i'm gonna do today who else loves these chips because these are literally my favorite chips all right so we got some green grapes in here also got a bunch of oranges because we ran out and we love oranges and i also love to do like freshly squeezed orange juice got a bunch of bars these are from aldi's i like to open up the package and throw away the boxes to recycle them and then i have a little container in my pantry area where i put them i got a bunch of avocados and onions because i literally put onions in everything that i cook i love 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 onions they're so good i also got a lot of lemons because we were running out and david loves loves making lemonade and i got a bunch of potatoes as well because i love me some potatoes any shape or form also got some parmesan cheese got some elotes have some spaghetti to make some pasta i think you're making shrimp pasta sometime soon we got a big ass bag of cheese because we love cheese we eat cheese with like everything as well i also got one more thing of chicken at the store at aldi's they were actually not letting people buy more than two containers of chicken and that was with like all the meat so pork and everything like that you can only get two per person got some liquid liquid egg whites because david loves egg whites i honestly don't i hate them also got a big thing of butter i cook with a lot of butter and i have some baking soda to clean with and do the laundry with if you see my bags they're from sketchers and from box lunch i we don't really use the plastic bags we always bring our own either way at aldi's you can't they don't have plastic bags so you have to have your own bag this bag i have some grape juice and i also got apple juice we don't usually get juices because we drink a lot of water but lately we've been in the mood of drinking like some type of sweet juice or something like that so those are the two that we went with i got two bags of shrimp because lately i've been wanting to cook some shrimp you know some seafood so i got two bags of shrimp i also got four cans of coconut milk i love cooking with this especially like instead of using regular milk i will use this milk and it's so freaking good i absolutely love it also got some tomato and basil pasta sauce and i got some cocktail sausages i love these for breakfast they're really good so my friend Melina always comes over to cook and when she comes over she always brings her old old bay seasoning but one day she didn't and she was so upset I don't cook with this but she does so when she comes over I have this and I'm also gonna try it on my food because it's really good she cooks delicious so I got some so when she comes it's already here you know I also got some sour cream they didn't have the regular sour cream so I got the light sour cream I hope it's still good because we love this. Alright, this is the last bag from Aldi. I got some pita chips, some English muffins, and some bagels. Love this. I didn't get any other type of bread, just these two. These are the rest of the bars that David got. So these are Fiber Now Cinnamon and Coffee Cake ones. And then these are Chewy Chocolate Chip ones, and he got two of those. I don't really eat these. For snacks, I like saltier stuff instead of sweeter things. I also got two boxes of mac and cheese. Because, you know, I was feeling a little bit mac and cheesy. And I got two bags of brown sugar, which is the sugar that we use. But we ran out, so now we're just using our white sugar. Once that runs out, we'll start using these. Also, got some tortillas. And these are the corn ones. They're really good for, like, tacos or you can fry them and make chips and stuff like that. And I have some cream cheese for my bagels. And David got this. It is coconut cashew crisps chocolate. So they're really nice. And that's everything we got at Aldi's. Now at Walmart, we got three sauces. We got Boom Boom Shrimp Sauce. We got the Yum Yum Sauce. And we got some Sriracha because we're running out of Sriracha. So got a big one. I also got some curry powder from Walmart. And I got these beans. They're refried beans. And these are so good. This is the best brand. I mean, well, the best brand is the one from Costa Rica. But they don't have that one here. But this one is also really, really, really good. This with some tortillas. Heaven. Period. Try it out. It's so freaking good. And you can put a little bit of butter and like ketchup on this and heat it up and mix it. 
so good. We also got some jasmine rice. And then this is not really food related, but wax melts for wax melters. So the house can smell nice. This one is fireside. This one is coastal sunset. This one is lemon lavender. So that's everything I got at Walmart. I didn't get that much. All these literally had everything I needed. So the only reason why I didn't get this stuff there is because they didn't have it or they had a different version of it. Like the jasmine rice, they only had the instant jasmine rice and it wasn't that much. I wanted a bigger uh, thing of it. So we went, <gasps> why are you hot? So I made a big mess everywhere. So that's everything. Now I'm going to try to organize the fridge a little bit. So I already did the top part. We have our eggs, our egg whites, and then our butter. And then we have two of these. The other one is in the back. So that's going to be the top part. I'm thinking milks and juices will go here. Maybe fruit. I always keep like the dairy and like breakfast kind of stuff in here. And then veggies go in these two. And then I have to organize this as well because it's a freaking mess. And we have some new sauces that we have to put in here too. I just looked down and there's a bag on the floor. And I don't know why, but I thought it was juniper. So I bought this milk at Aldi's not too long ago. And it fucking sucks. I It tastes so bad. I don't know why. I hate it. Absolutely not. I always get stuff to try it out and be like fun and outgoing and like spontaneous. And it fucking sucks. Look, this shit. I don't know if you guys have ever tried this, but this is so gross. And I thought it was like a creamer. Never put this in your coffee because it's disgusting. So now I just have it in the back of my fridge. I will come up with something to make this into. Also, prune juice, not that good. I didn't get this one, but it's not that good. I'm gonna show you guys what I did. I don't have pretty containers for the fridge, so if that's what you're here for, you may leave now because I don't have pretty containers. But I did organize it a little bit, so I'll show you guys. I decided to put all my eggs here with the butter, the egg whites at the back, and then the sour cream and cream cheese up here. Then I did milks, juice, and then this is my cinnamon. I drink cinnamon water every day. I love it, it's really good. So I did that there. Down here, I have some fruits, some lemons, some juices, and like pickles and stuff. Over here, I have my breakfast stuff. So I have my cheese, my bacon, my ham and stuff, and my sausages. Over here, I have some dips. So I have this really good French onion dip. It's actually vegan. And I have some hummus, and these are leftover. So we know where, what we have left over that we can eat. So I have it here. And then here we have some tomatoes, cucumber, cilantro and stuff here. I put the corn, the onions, the peppers, the mushrooms, all that stuff. At the door, we have some waters, some uh, pesto and garlic, and this is some aguardiente. And then here we have the creamer, the peanut butter, some um, garlic as well. And then all the sauces, I put them together. So the sriracha's, uh, this is really good. This is like a taco sauce, guacamole sauce is really good for like tacos and meat, all the stuff. And then we have some cottage cheese and feta cheese. David's mom is the one that usually uses that, so it's there. So yeah, that's what the fridge part is looking like. I'm gonna do the freezer. We just have the veggies, frozen veggies up here. Then we have frozen fruit, and then we have our meats, which is chicken, turkey, and shrimp. And at the bottom, I just have my vegan stuff, which is groundless beef and then some chicken nuggets for when I was gonna go vegan. I have some frozen veggies that are open here and some coconut flakes. So yeah, originally I had bought a bunch of vegan meats and stuff like that because I was going to go vegan again, but then I decided I didn't wanna do it. I think that part of my life is over and it's really sad. I loved being vegan, it was so good. I just don't think, at least not right now, I just don't wanna do it. Like, sounds horrible. I am trying to eat more healthy. Um, I don't really eat pork or stuff like that. I mostly eat chicken and like seafood. I mean, that's better than nothing, right? I am trying to cut out dairy as well. I know you guys saw a shit ton of cheese and a shit ton of sour cream, but 
I am just don't put it as much or use it as much as I used to. At least I'm trying. I'm really trying. But that is my grocery haul slash organizing my fridge. I think that's what I'm going to do today. Tomorrow, I will be organizing my pantry stuff. So that will be really fun. Uh, I do have some nice containers for that. So if you guys want to watch that video, you're going to have to wait till it comes out. So yeah. Anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching my video. Now I have to put away all this shit that didn't go in the fridge. It's not that much. Anyways, I hope everybody is staying safe. I think I'm going to go back to work on Saturday. It, today is Wednesday, so I think I'm going back to work Saturday. I'm not sure yet, but anyways, I hope you guys are staying safe. I love you so much, and I'll see you next time.